short little video here to demonstrate. This is Jennifer, my office manager. We're, uh, she's got a little next stuff going on today. Um, I'm just going to show how I would go straight forward to see how her neck might need to be addressed. So, where is it hurting? Um, just range of motion. Oh. Oh. oh, so if you go this way. A little tight on the left. This way. Uh, more restricted. So, pain with either one? Mm -hmm. No? Um, not really pain, just okay, there. Just good. Sure. Okay, the other, this way. A little tighter on that side, maybe. Not too bad, but you now bring your head back. Any pain with that? Uh, between my shoulders. Okay, so that puts pain between your shoulders. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, let's have you sit here facing that way. So these are going to be uh, pretty much all session one muscles that we did this weekend. Bring your head forward, slight turn. This is the scalenes muscle I'm doing it one hand in. On the right side, feels pretty good. Right there on the left side, that feels pretty good. Coming all the way forward, all the way left, this is SCM. I'm going to test, my vector is this, this way. Hold there, good. And then this way, my supporting hand is on her upper back. Now the way we we're doing it this weekend, I was having you guys in front, turning this way, and hold. And we're still getting the same result. <clears throat> this is a little more accurate test, a little more accurate way to do it. And that's really good. So enough of me there. <clears throat> now, right shoulder up, head over, slight turn, upper trapezius on the right. Very good. Shoulder up, slight turn, upper trapezius on the left. Maybe a little bit. Hold it. Yeah, not not quite. Okay, something went on with that. Okay. And there is some neck stuff on the left. So I am also going to go to her deltoid. On the right, we can pull that off for a second. Too. Bring your shoulder up this way, looking straight ahead. Hold there. Deltoid, something going on there. Let's try this side. Hold there. Hold. That one's pretty good. Um, that deltoid is not happy. Now I'm going to do the serratus. We didn't learn that this weekend, but. You saw me do it a number of times. The serratus isn't firing. Hold there. That one's pretty good. That's the serratus anterior. Hold there. This is the long head triceps. One way to test it. The other way would be to test it this way. Both of those aren't firing well. Serratus, triceps, long head, deltoid. Uh, what else might we have here um, on the right? This is pectoralis major clavicular, and that's not too happy. That's not, not too happy there. Left pectoralis major clavicular, that's good. Let's do the pectoralis major sternal. I'm pushing towards her opposite knee, or she's pushing towards her opposite knee. Now that one's good, that one's good. Push towards the opposite knee, and that's good. So, bunch of stuff here. So the complaint, the patient's complaint is in the neck. We found some range of motion, found it to be a little glitchy, even though the overall range of motion is not too bad. I'm palpating now and I'm feeling there's like her C4 is kind of rotated this way a little bit and there's not symmetry in the way that the the muscles along the back of the neck feel. There's just kind of a ropiness more on one side than the other. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do, where the C4 feels subluxated, you saw me do this this last weekend, I'm going to turn her head until it feels like that vertebrae moves back towards where it should be. It needs to rotate this way. So I'm going to hover, hold her head in that position right there. Now we'll go back to these arm muscles. Oop, up there. Push down. A little bit. Push down. Yeah, way different. Way different. Uh, keep your head just like that. Push, push. Very, very good. Um, deltoid. Okay. Perfect. So 
we've got to clear the neck here before we do anything with the shoulder. And the shoulder may not need uh, too much after we get the neck adjusted.